Now at 6.30, we are tracking the tropics, another named storm off the Atlantic. So let's send it over to CBS4 Chief Meteorologist Craig Setzer, joining us now with the latest on Josephine. Craig. Hi, Carly. Josephine is no more. The last advisory has been written on Josephine. There it is, just kind of a clump of thunderstorms. And you'll see right through the day, there was a little swirl that was the uh, center of Josephine, but now it has pretty much dissipated. So now we're just talking about what we call the remnants of Josephine. Uh, just a little stamp of an L right there. Also, Kyla's gone now. So no named storms in the Atlantic, but we're already watching two new waves. This wave, we talked about it yesterday, headed towards the islands here. Medium development potential for later in the week here once it gets into the Caribbean. We'll keep an eye on that. Plus, that wave we talked about, the big one that came off of Africa yesterday, it also has a medium development potential middle or latter part of the week once it gets into the central and western parts of the deep Atlantic there. We will watch this one very, very closely. It's very far away right now, but time of year where we watch things that come out of this part of the Atlantic, we, the area we call the main development region. Here's a radar right now across South Florida, and it has quieted down after another round of midday and afternoon storms. We may see a stray storm this evening. We'll repeat this pattern uh, throughout the week. More on what's going on here and the tropics coming up.